Cities tend to be places of, of refuge. You know, whether you're talking about a refuge from a, a, a natural disaster, uh, from a drought. You know, disasters happen, conflicts happen, people often are, are fleeing from a countryside or a remote coastal area, and they're coming into urban settings. And there can be a lot of marginalisation uh, with that. Uh, so the role that cities play in, in being inclusive, in catering for newcomers, and trying to ensure proper settlement, and setting a, a tone for the public of uh, civility, tolerance, acceptance of diversity, this is incredibly important. And you mentioned there tolerance, and obviously the last few years the, the government landscape is changing a little bit, people's attitudes towards aid are changing. How is that impacting those people that really are in need? Well, quite badly, and because our world is also somewhat overwhelmed by long-running conflicts, uh, a lot of the traditional international solidarity dollar is going to sheer relief, uh, and there's less for development. Investment in human development, economic development, uh, political participation, open societies, could of course head off some of the wars and conflicts. But it's, it's hard to get on the front foot when the sheer needs to keep people alive, fed with water, basic tent over one's head, uh, are so compelling. So it, it is a concern. Are there more steps the development community can be taking to kind of fill that gap and make sure that people aren't going without? Well, I do think it, it's extremely important that there's a, a development focus in the immediate relief operation as well. Uh, because humanitarian relief is important but insufficient in itself. Uh, people want to move to self-sufficiency uh, as soon as they can. It, it's of course good to have refuge from war and conflict, but to sit in a tent for years on end is not a life for any person or family. So ensuring that people have access to opportunity when they seek refuge within their country or, or over borders. This is very, very important and I'm fully uh, supportive of all the development partners being involved at the earliest stage.